patterns using alphabets recognizing alphabet patterns kids today we will learn about recognizing rules of alphabet patterns applying the recognized rule to continue the pattern come let's go to music class today meet sarla madam she teaches music to pinku rinku neeraj diya and chinu hello kids how are you all ma'am i got a sore throat oh this is because of weather change do gargle with some warm water well let me take attendance for today ma'am why neeraj's name is before mine I was the first one to take admission in your class. Can any one of you tell me why I have put Neeraj's name before Pinku's? I'll tell because Neeraj sings better than Pinku. No, this is not good. You all sing so well. Now think carefully. You have written all the names in alphabetical order. As Pinku's name starts with P and Neeraj's name starts with N. And in alphabets N comes before P. So Neeraj's name is written before Pinku. Very good. Ma'am, our school teacher has also written names in the same order. Writing all names alphabetically is a kind of pattern. So We can say this is a pattern made of alphabets. Ma'am, are there any more examples of alphabetical patterns? Yes, of course. Let's see. Well, you all know about the seven musical notes, right? Yes, yes. Sa re ga ma pa dha ni. These musical notes are also made up of alphabets. Come, let's make some patterns using musical notes today. Before making patterns, one should remember that there is no fixed rule for making patterns. You can make your own rule to make patterns. These are the seven musical notes. Let's make some patterns using this. Can you fill in the blanks? After re re will come ga ga. After pa pa will come dha dha. Oh wow, you have done it so quickly. Is there any rule in this pattern? Yes, we are repeating each note twice. Come, let us all sing this together. Kids, you can also sing together. Come, let's make a new pattern now. Can we take three notes together? Yes, why not? If we take three notes together like this, sa, re, ga, then What will come after this? Hmm, re ga ma. I will say after this, ga ma pa. Wow. Ma pa tha. Wow. Pa dha ni. Very good. So, what is the rule of this pattern? We are leaving the first note and using the corresponding three notes each time. Very good. So kids, today we have learnt about recognizing rules of alphabet patterns and applying the recognized rule to continue the pattern.